I am in. Well, I won't tell you where. We'll let it be known later. I'm about eight hours from home. I'm catching skippies, skipjack herring. Let's see if I can catch one. Watch, I won't be able to catch one once I go live. But let's see if I can catch one. Let's see if we can get this done. I'm using a regular shad rig like you use for hickory shad on the east coast. You can see that. Let's see if we can get one. What's going on? I don't have my glasses on, but I can see somebody's on there. Catching some skippies. Gonna get home on the wall. about eight hours from home down here to see my boy watch well, they're not gonna bite now right here this current's coming around this wall there's slack water creating an eddy there he is fish on fish on There we go guys, skip jack hang. Similar to hickory shad on the east coast. Let's see if I can get another one. Hitting Barbie Garland and glow shads. He's good. Let's try again. What we got going on here? Yep. I've tried for some stripers and hybrids, but I haven't had any luck with them. But to tell you the truth, these skippies are about more fun than them. Let's see. There he is, right there. Fish on. Got another one. Got a good jump. All oh, right, came off. Got in the eye. He broke me off. I've been 
pulling these up the um, railing so much. I'm gonna retie, guys. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. I'm gonna retie. Alright guys, gotta retie. I pulled so many up this rail on it. This is eight pound line, but it's not that heavy obviously. To be pulling a two some of these are two pounds. I'm gonna tie this the same way I tie my shad rig. I'll show you that. Let this one slide down the line. Might have to put my readers on, but I don't want to do that on live TV or YouTube. Improved clinch knot. Use the nose right there. Bobby Garn Glow Shads. I saw these in a Walmart the other day and I'm getting ready to start doing a lot of crabby fishing, but I figured they'd be good for shad and crabby. So I got this one on the end. This one put about a foot away. I'm not going to be able to see this with this line, but double it up, do a loop knot, go back through it twice. And there you have it. I've got that on a little loop, and then this on the bottom. Biggest one, guys. If I can get him up this wall. Oh, oh, yeah. Guys, there's a nice skippy. That one's a good two pounds at least. Hey. <laughs> I wonder if Steve's watching. Steve, you out there? Get him back in the water, but they look just like hickory shad, close cousins. Get him back in the water. 
He's good. I'm turning this GoPro on. I just don't see me catch another one on both cameras. There he is. Ah! Oh. Kill him. There he is. Ah! Lost him again. Alright, let's see. Let's see how long it takes now. Okay, this river is just chock full of fish. Reminds me a lot of the Roanoke. Mm. What we got out there? Let me see if I can see this. Yeah, It's going away. I'll leave it right there. Oh, he jumped two foot out of the water. Guys, I don't know how good you can hear me. This one jumped like two foot out of the water. He's not as big. Right there, hitting the glow shed. Not a big one. They're fun to kick. They always want to keep kicking too. Keep, but they'll die quick, so get them back in the water. All right, he's good. If you don't know where I at, the screen may tell you where I'm at at the bottom, but I'm standing in Georgia right now, and Alabama's just, a, I can see right across the river. best one. Oh, I got a double. Guys, I got a double. I don't know how I'm going to get a double up.
Guys, that's what we're talking about, double right there. Get you some of that, Steve and Melvin. Woo! Getting them back in the water. That's what we're talking about right there. They're good. I gotta go get my rod now, it's over the fence. All right, guys, that was my first double. I've shad fished, I don't know, four or five times this year in North Carolina for hickory shad and uh, American shad. I've actually got two videos haven't done when my wife smoked me catching big American shad. She caught a couple of four and five pound American shad and all I caught was one little gizzard chad. She smoked me that day. I did catch a nice bass that day. Let me see who's out here. No, I'm not going to take any home for big cats. I don't even have a, I didn't even bring a cooler with me. That one's toast. But, uh, then I got another shad video coming out where I didn't, uh, it's a spot I usually shad fish, but the shad don't get up there every year. And the first day I caught nothing but bass. I would shad fish and switch to bass fishing. Then I go back to shad fishing and I caught um, nothing but bass. And so then, yep, the river's a little muddy here, but not too bad. Um, but anyway, I went back the next day on that spot where I was only catching bass and um, I caught one nice American shad and about a four pound bass. So I got two videos coming out on shad that I haven't even edited yet. Like I said, one where my wife smokes me on big um, white shad, American shad, and one where I catch a bunch of bass and one shad. Steve, you better catch up, Steve. I saw you pose. We'll get one more.
There you go right there, guys. That Bobby Garland glow shad is killing it. This isn't the biggest one either, but he's fun. These smaller ones jump. He jumped like two foot out of the air. I'll have this on the video too. Well, I actually caught my first skippy yesterday that I've ever caught. Um, so I'll have it out on the video in a couple of weeks. But there it is. GoPro still got battery. That boy right there was hooked. All right, guys, I guess I'm gonna end it. Put him back. All right, guys, I guess I'm gonna end this. I don't even know how to end this live stream. This is the first live stream I've ever done. Um, but anyway, guys, hit the subscribe button. It's Steve the Dude. You better take me hunting to kill a turkey. No, Steve, these don't, these, these skipjack heron are totally fresh water. Close cousins to hickory shad, but they don't go into the gulf. They're in rivers that feed the gulf, but they don't go into the gulf. What's up, sea breeze? Woo! It's a good day. Maybe I'll catch one more. Does anybody want to see me catch one more? I think I'm gonna be divorced when I get back to the the Airbnb or whatever it is. Um, all right, let's catch one more so Steve can see what a fish looks like um, in Melbourne. We got here. Sea breeze. I wish I could catch about ten more, but it's gonna get dark. And like I said. Um, I'm gonna go home and watch the game. Like I said, I may be divorced when I get back. But anyway, let's get one more. That one shot. That's what I'm using right there.
I got to do an ending for my other video. I'm doing a video right now. So I got to do an ending for it. And Steve, Steve, don't you owe me some money? I think you owe me some money. But anyway, we'll talk about that later. I snagged that little guy. There's a bunch of these shad down there that the hybrids and white bass are eating. That's good bait right there. Yeah. Maybe getting too dark for them to see these things, guy, but these things glow. Guys, I smell some serious weed. Somebody near me smoking some serious weed. Steve, you wouldn't know nothing about that, would you? All right, guys, here's the last one. I'm gonna end it on this. Do me a favor, I know most of y'all are probably subscribers, but if you're not subscribing, hit the subscribe button. Okay, these are fun things. Anyway, I'm out if I can get this thing off camp, off alive. Woo! I don't know how to end this thing.